Poor Jay still can't get in. just finished skating and this is the site behind me and I just want to take a moment out to appreciate this beautiful scenery around me and to remind you to appreciate the beautiful scenery around you as well so here's this little path that I'm just strolling down looking at the bridge and now I'm gonna be in Jay's picture that's gonna be high feet bro let me see it Look, damn. That's gonna be sick, bro. Look at your hand. Dude, damn. Yeah, dope. I think it's gonna be sick. I think so too. Okay, so if you're watching this, this is your reminder. Take a second out of your day. Deep breath. Enjoy the moment. All the scenes around you because everything is not permanent. Everything's not gonna last. Everything's gonna be different. It could be good, could be bad, but the beauty of it is whatever you're enjoying right now, you should continue enjoying it. Yo, it's been a while since I hopped on here, so let's do a little update of what's going on. So everything's still good, uh, life is great. And ever since that realization at 27 to like start getting my stuff together, I uh, started working a lot harder, doing different things. So I'll update you on what's been going on with my professional life. Sorry I haven't been vlogging as much because, well, I mean, I've just got work to do. And once I figure all this out, I think I'll be able to come back and vlog more and show you guys and everyone what the behind the scenes are, what I'm creating, what I've been up to. I mean, right now I'm just uh, at someone's house doing a Facebook ad meeting since I'm running some ads for this really cool restaurant nearby. Um, it's like actually one of those top award winning restaurants and there's like some super cool viral videos on it. My favorite or one of the favorite things I have about this company is that like one of the co-owners has this really famous startup or company that they had before and it's called GoFundMe and I remember when I first met like one of the one of the guys I was like talking to him and he was telling me about his business and how his earlier startup was pretty successful and then I was like alright what, uh, what was your earlier startup name maybe I heard of it or, or something then he was like, it's called GoFundMe. And then I was like, oh my God, I freaking used GoFundMe. I got hundreds of dollars off of GoFundMe because yeah, I've been doing that and I've been shooting a lot. I've been modeling for a few brands. So that's been pretty interesting. It's like changing my route from like just being a creator into being someone that's able to do all these different types of online digital marketing and just seeing that side of things. And with this channel too, I feel like at this point in life, I can keep vlogging and you guys might get tired of it but if I were to do like more interesting things like show how I could live this lifestyle that I'm living because right now like I'm living comfortably but it's still pretty hard like I still have to go out and hustle and if I hustle really hard I mean I can't spend that much time vlogging because I'm just worn out so this year I'm putting some systems in place so that I could you know still hustle but at the same time bring the same amount of value to people so I get paid the same amount and if I could do that I could have some more free time to vlog and put stuff together and go out and do more fun things and update you guys so that'll be it for this one it'll be kind of short but I think my vlogs are gonna be a bit shorter but I just want to bring you along so you get a feel for the ride <music>